Well, I thought the key to the game, obviously, was we didn't give up. Uh, nothing was going our way all night. I thought Washington State played great. Rodman uh, was awesome tonight for them. Uh, I thought they'd be ready to play. I think they're a team that only played four home games all year, which is unbelievable. It puts a lot of stress and strain on your team playing all those games away from home, not just to travel, but it's hard to get, hard to get your confidence rolling. So uh, I thought we'd be in a dogfight tonight. I didn't think that we would get down the way we got down, but really proud of the way our guys battled back. A lot of ways to win a game tonight. We were able to convert 21 out of 22 at the foul line. I think that was the, that was the biggest key, and then Jaime got it going late uh, for us, and our defense got going late too. Your team trailed by five with four minutes to go. Talk about those final four minutes and then that final minute. And I, I think they maybe had one basket in the last four minutes. So, you know, that's the key. You got to get stops down the stretch, close games, conference games. None of these games are easy. I think people look at records and rankings and they, they don't understand that the home matters, um, psychology of the schedule. Like I said earlier, they hadn't been at home. They played a lot of tough ones on the road. Um, and I think our guys were our nine day break, feeling probably too good about ourselves. And we finally got back to realizing why we're, why we've started playing well. Our defense, excuse me. So, you know, our defense was the key down the stretch to your question, obviously, that the last four minutes, our defense was the key. Talk about that made the, free throws. the performances there in the last minute from Will McClendon, a Dembona, two freshmen, big yeah. plays in the last minute. Yeah, I mean, it was a couple times we look out there, you know, um, with uh, we had a dem out there and Will uh, a lot at the same time, but I I, I think uh, give Will a lot of credit through a great pass to a dem to win the, you know to get us the one point lead. It took a lot of guts to make that play to make that pass. It was it was on time. It was on target. Excellent pass by Will. The dem did a good job of catching and taking his time uh, to get it up and in. For, you know, forced the goal ten. So. Uh, but it's always good to uh, it's all, always good to 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 get a win like this. It's like money in the bank. You know, you don't want to have to go through it. But uh, like I told the guys in the locker room, um, you know, to to try to do special things, you're going to have to win games like this. You're going to you know you're going to have to just grind one out, get a W, and get on to the next one. So I think um, th this this could go a long way for us. Last question, how big was the free throw line? Oh, huge. When you go 20 years, a lot, I told the guy, a lot of ways to win games, you know. Most underrated thing in basketball, made free throws. Made free throws. We're plus 11 at the foul line. You know, they, the way they were defending us at the rim, we had to start, get, we had to get fouled. Um, the way they were, they were being physical around the rim and trying to block everything. We quick shot, missed a lot of layups, we didn't do it. But there was a time we were four for 19 to start the game. So we had to slow down, get the ball up and in, or get to the free throw line, uh, or we were never going to score. So Jaime made some adjustments to their defense as the game went on. But, uh, you know, to your point, uh, obviously, uh, you go 21 for 22. We needed all 21 of them tonight to get the W. Thank you.